I'm experiencing it right now. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, yeah. Runner's high is definitely a real thing. I mean, the runner's high, it's, it definitely exists. I think it's, it's, it's really there in the marathon. You focus on anything for three hours so intently and you're that immersed in it, you can't help but feel something uh, amazing at the end. It's, it just, it happens, you know. You just felt like you were gliding. You know, every step was, you know, easier than the step before. I haven't had that for a couple years, so I think I'm due for it. It's like this motion that you're just like a well-oiled machine. You just, everything's great, life is happy, you're smiling, um, and you, you just keep going. And then that even translates into later in the day. It's just you keep reflecting back on that, that run that went so well, and you're like, wow, that was great. Just, you're just happy. <laughs> You definitely have that moment where it's like, what's happening? My brain's a little tingly right now just thinking about it. Definitely the runner's high you're feeling is an endorphin release from your brain. That gives you a sense of like, you can kind of accomplish anything. It feels like you're running with the wind. It, say you're running against a headwind for a couple miles and then you turn around and all of a sudden you have this tailwind. That's kind of like a runner's high. It's having a tailwind even when there isn't and you're kind of like just floating. The runner's hangover is brutal though. Oof. 